One of the exciting things about Single Store Kai for MongoDB is that it can enable MongoDB applications with AI-powered features. We've added Single Store DB's fast SIMD accelerated vector operations to the Single Store Kai for MongoDB API, such as the dot product expression, that can be used to power state-of-the-art semantic search. This is really fun stuff. And if you want to follow along, this whole demo is up in our GitHub examples repository. I'm no expert in this area, but I was able to add semantic search to a sample MongoDB e-commerce bookstore application powered by Single Store with just a few API calls to OpenAI. My ulterior motive for picking this scenario was to find some new science fiction books to read, and it actually worked. For this demo, first I downloaded a set of 15,000 science fiction novels from the Open Library. This dataset included just the titles, subjects, keywords, and descriptions of the books. This came in the form of JSON data like many datasets. Then I used a small Node.js program to add an embedding field to each document. The embedding represents the meaning of the text as identified by an AI model. To get it, I passed the JSON blob for each book to the OpenAI embeddings endpoint with the text embedding auto 2 model. I loaded this data into single store using the MongoDB Node.js driver and annotated it with some synthetic information about prices, inventory, etc. for the demo. Finally, I wrote a simple Node.js web service that takes a user's query, gets an embedding from OpenAI, and find similar books using Single Store Kai for MongoDB. And to my surprise, it really worked. Let's jump to the terminal and see a few examples. So the neat thing about this type of search is it functions more on the meaning of words, not keywords or phrases like more traditional forms of search. So for example, I can query my API with uh, hard science fiction moon versus earth and get the top five matches and there you see the moon is a harsh mistress which is the book I was thinking of uh, show up at the top uh, let's try something a bit more ambiguous it's been a long time since I've read this one but let's search for some guy rides along with a submarine captain classic French and you can see 20,000 leagues under the sea pops up in the top results and let's do one more. How about a uh, funny astronaut stranded on Mars has to survive movie. And there you see the Martian coming up at the very top. So I spent way too much time playing with this. It's fun because it feels like you're using a search service like Google or Bing, but it's all happening here within your own database, which means you can do some really cool things uh, with it that I'll demonstrate later. Uh, finally, though, the whole point of this demo was to find some new books to read. So I'm going to search for uh, hard science fiction, classic nebula near future. And here are some results. Uh, I've already read that one. I've read that one. I think I've read this one. Uh, but Noamanon, definitely don't recognize that. I have not read this book. So let's grab the ID and let's jump to the Mongo shell and run a few more queries uh, to show some more of what we can do with this. So I'm going to connect to the same instance of single store Kai for MongoDB that we were just connected to through the API. You can see from the welcome message here that this is a single store instance. And let's find that same book that we had just found. So um, db.processed.find1. We'll search ID is object ID of what's hopefully still in my clipboard. There it is. And let's just confirm the title. It's the right one. So I'm going to save the embedding for this into a variable. And the neat thing about this part of it is this does not require OpenAI at all. Because the embeddings are all already here in the database, it all happens just within single store. So we can use this embedding, for example, for Noamanon to find some similar books to that one. Uh, so let me grab that query. So here I'm going to use uh, a query very similar to the one I was doing earlier through the API, except instead of finding similar books to my search query embedding, I'm finding similar books to the Noamanon embedding. And you can see here that it is uh, most similar to itself, which you would expect. 
Uh, but here's another one that's probably in the same series with the same title and some other related books. So I can really use this to discover uh, similar novels to ones that I really like. Um, but the really interesting thing about having it all here in the database is we can combine the semantic search with other filters. So for example, say I wanted to uh, find similar books, but I needed the price to be less than 20. I can just add that filter, price less than 20. And in addition to searching for similarity uh, to Noomenon, it's also finding only books that meet that criteria. So this type of search uh, is really powerful. I think that the combination of uh, the traditional MongoDB query operators with semantic search is going to power a lot of really interesting uh, applications, and I can't wait to try it out more myself. Uh, you can read through this same demo and find more information on Single Store Kai uh, from the links here. Thank you for sticking with me uh, to the very end.